welcome once again to my YouTube channel Lega Design Studio. I hope you're starting off this new year full of energy and new goals to achieve. Help this community growing by don't forgetting to subscribe if you're interested in the topics of this channel. My name is Lady and today I'll be talking about Miami latest luxury condominium under construction as we speak. Actually, this stunning new tower in Miami is close related to a very famous luxury car. And yes, you guessed it correctly in the comments of my previous video, this is no other than Aston Martin Residence. Keep watching until the end, you might find out how to get an Aston Martin car of your own. This idea of the new luxury building in Miami was the fruit of two very creative individuals who display design excellence each on very different functional products of the everyday life. Cars and house appliances. They are Marek Reckman, Aston Martin Chief Creative Officer, and Spen Pake Gaganau, Head of Design. Marek and Spain decided to join in a venture for a different product this time, luxury living. Actually, Aston Martin and Gaganau are brands that excel in the search of outside-the-box design solutions without compromising the functionality of their products. This time, to make this humongous, gorgeous building, they join forces with property developer GNG Business Development. Uh, guys, this ultra luxury skyscraper will be located at 300 Biscay Boulevard Way. It's where Miami River meets Biscayne Bay. And it's actually one of the few pieces of land bordered with Miami water from that is still available. Uh, designed as a 66 story tower, Aston Martin will stand out its surrounding buildings. But high won't be the only thing that will make this building to stand out, but all the amenities that I will be covering towards the end of this video. If you haven't done so, please give a thumbs up to this video and don't forget to subscribe. This new 66-story tower will embody all living styles. The 391 units will range from 1 to 5 bedrooms. This building will accommodate all tastes and needs, with choices from luxury residences to duplexes. Additionally, for more exclusive owners, this building will also have 7 penthouses and a triple-level penthouse. This unique residence will take floors 63 through 65. And as you may have guessed, all these penthouses will have, will have its own private pool and its own private terrace space. And as you might imagine, uh, this luxury living style comes with a hefty price tag. And this one goes from $750,000 to $50 million. Actually, this uh, triple level penthouse that cost with, uh, that, that, which cost will be $50 million, will come actually with one of the only 24 Aston Martin's Vulcan's car ever made. Remember when I told you you may find out how to get an Aston Martin car of your own? This is it. You only need to buy one of the most expensive residences in this building. Pretty easy, right? Okay. <laughs> All hidden aside, uh, Aston Martin residence was designed by Revolta Architecture and Bola Smiane and her architects. Revolta Architecture is the same uh, company that uh, was in charge of the design of Flat Island Tower, another iconic building in Miami, uh, completed in 2019 that I mentioned in one of my previous videos. You can check it out in the link above. And um, Boda Smiane Architects uh, is famous for their uh, outstanding landmarks uh, properties. Okay, guys, let's now talk about some of the amenities that this building will have. And of course, Aston Martin, being an exclusive brand, will want to have its signature all throughout this building. And that's exactly why the interior spaces and all the amenity spaces will gonna be designed by Aston Martin Designs team, led by no other than Chief Creative Officer Marek Reckman. Uh, all these amenity spaces will take floors 52 through 55, and they are gonna be connected by a massive glass staircase. Some of these amenities that we can mention for this uh, amazing new addition to our Miami skyline are two levels of fitness center with amazing views of the ocean. You also have a boxing gym. You also have a spinning studio, a virtual golf room. Um, for some world-class events, this building will also have a chef kitchen, a private dining room, and a catered kitchen. Uh, additionally, this building will include a business center, will include a art gallery, kids room, and also two theaters. For some pampering, we'll also have a full service spa, 
and also a beauty salon and a barber station will be included as well. Uh, also some exterior spaces will be infinity pool, a sky bar and lounge, a pool deck and a cabana will take place all floor 55. And guys, to top it off, something really, really unique for this new building is the Aston Martin residence will have a super jack marina for its guests and its owners. To, uh, this is a really good amenity to the all uh, extensive uh, list of amenities that are included in this new building. And of course, this building is going to be completed, as I mentioned, it's right now under construction and is expected to be completed in 2022. Okay guys, this is all for this gorgeous building. We are still over a year until we see this building completed. I'm gonna make sure to do a follow-up video once it's completed or once it's close to completion because sometimes during construction things change and because of budget and uh, reasons outside of the hands of the designer, uh, things in the concept are changing, uh, things are added or things are subtracted from the initial concept so I'm going to do a follow up if that's the case. I hope you found this video informative. If you want to hear more about topics related to architecture, to design, or interesting places where this can be integrated, please subscribe and let's keep learning together. Once more, welcome to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe and activate the notification button so you get my next video right as it comes out. So uh, next time, I'll actually be talking about Hudson Jar, a quite innovative place that I visited in New York this past Thanksgiving. Please let me know in the comments below if you have been at Hudson Jar, what you thought about it. I'm going to be covering uh, this um, new place in New York in my next video. Thank you for watching and don't forget to share with all your architecture loving friends. And I can't wait to share more content with you. Until next time. Bye guys. Thank <laughs> you.